guys, what's up? It's Raven, and I wanted to make another haul video. I feel like I've been making a lot of haul videos lately. I guess since it's kind of the holiday season and we're having sales and it's getting to be cold weather, it kind of gives me excuses to buy stuff because I want to take advantage of the sales and I want to get different types of clothes for the cold weather since I've been always buying kind of warm weather clothes. I need cold weather clothes now and kind of holiday clothes. So I guess that's why I've been buying a lot of stuff and therefore making a lot of hauls. So here's yet again another haul and this is basically like my Christmas haul because I'm going to show you Christmas presents and Christmas presents that I bought for myself and yeah so let's just get right into it. Today is actually Christmas Day so a couple maybe like two weeks ago I went into Charlotte Russe and they were having kind of their holiday sale was that they had like a five dollar rack, a ten dollar rack, a twenty dollar rack and then they had some other stuff on sale so of course I went straight to the five dollar rack because I was like okay cheapest thing in the store I know that there looks like there's cute stuff on there so I'm gonna find something ahead and got some stuff from Charlotte Russe and um, a lot of the things I'm showing you in this haul if you follow me on Instagram you have probably already seen most of them because I always take pictures of the stuff that I buy and put it on Instagram. My Instagram is at Raven Elise. Every link will be down below. So I only spent $10 at Charlotte Russe because I bought two $5 items. The first thing, I wanted to kind of get an outfit because sometimes I buy way too many tops and then I don't buy any bottoms to go with them. So I was like, let me get something that can actually go together this time. So I got this little crop top and this is not winter clothes at all. It's kind of like going out clothes I guess I could still wear them in the winter if I'm going out somewhere and I'm gonna be inside but yeah cuz it's a crop top and it's basically like a little crop tank top and it has like a pink underlay a really pretty kind of baby pink color and then a black overlay it's kind of this lace or crochet pattern like so and I just thought that it was a cool effect and a cool little cute little crop top that you can pair with a lot of different things like high-waisted things and skirts and pants and leggings and whatnot. Um, so I got a skirt to kind of go with it in a way. It's just a black fringe skirt and I actually have a shirt from Forever 21 that is exactly like this. It has the same fringe going all over it. So I could kind of wear the top and this skirt together and it would probably look like a dress. So I might wear it like that. And yeah, it's just a plain black mini skirt, but it just is covered in fringe on the front and back, which I thought was really cool. And like I said, those two things are only $5 each. So then the next group of things that I got was when um, I work at Wet Seal again, and we get our employee discount, and we were already having a holiday sale, so it was like... 50% off holiday sale for everyone and then we have our employee discount on top of that for the holidays so I was like let me just go ahead and rack up on some stuff while I can get stuff for like two dollars so I just went around the store and basically had my little shopping spree and just picked out whatever I liked so I'm going to show you all those things um in no particular order I went on the clearance rack I got this dress it's like a very pale kind of pinkish lavender color with a black like kind of zebra stripe going across it. It's a strapless dress with a little leather waistband which I thought was cool and edgy. And it's just flowy and short, just a little party dress. I have no idea where I'm going to wear this but I could probably make it casual depending on what I wear with it. Wear black combat boots with it instead of heels so I can like wear it to class or whatever. But I just thought it was cute. It was very cheap. I think it came out to be like literally two dollars. Another dress that I also got off the clearance rack is this one. Also was like two dollars. Um, I liked it because of the mesh top and it has the little eyelet in the back. The rest of the dress is just this really cool pink fabric and it's a really cute little shape, little short party dress and I don't know, I just thought it was really cute and I knew I could wear it somewhere, somehow, especially since it was only $2. I had to have it. I really like this style where they have the mesh at the top and then, yeah. And this last dress that I got also off the clearance rack, um, you've definitely seen me wear, hopefully if you saw my last video, my holiday look video. I was wearing this silver dress 
And this is my favorite dress. I just really like the metallic material. I like the shape of the dress. I love the back of the dress, how it has these little lines going across the back. It's a very simple silhouette, but the fabric is really cool and I thought it looked nice on me. So it was a really good deal for like $2 once again. So I got three dresses off the clearance rack. Then I got one dress um, that was not on clearance. And this dress was really popular. I was there on the day when we got it in. And that first day when we had this dress, everyone was buying it. And then from then on out, they were totally selling out. We had it in this mint color. We had it in a royal blue. We had it in, um, I think like, per no, a coral color. And yeah, it was just really popular. So I had to have it. And it's just this strapless dress with the black bodice and the flowy like chiffon bottom and it's a high-low dress which was really what brought my eye to it and I love this mint color I am obsessed with this mint color and we have a lot of stuff in the store that is this color right now so yeah I got this dress and regularly priced I think it was like $29.50 but with all of my discounts it probably only cost me like Let's see, 50% off, so that's already 15. Then another discount off of that, it probably cost me less than $10 to get this dress. So it was a really good deal and it was really popular. I wore it to work, I posted it on Instagram. Everybody was complimenting me on it at work and I was like, oh, I would sell it to you, it's from this store, but we already sold out because it's so popular. So I really, really love this dress. Then I got two pullovers. Um, the first one caught my eye just because it kind of has a lot going on. It's this gray pullover, but I really like how the edges are made to look kind of like raw. And then I really love the design on it with the skull and everything. And the skull actually has like a lot of detail to it. So I really liked that and I just thought it was really cool, really edgy, but it's also just like a very soft sweater, really easy to throw on, but you know, it's better than throwing on an ugly plain sweater. You can throw on this sweater, still be warm and comfortable, but still look really awesome. And this sweater is regularly priced $22.50, but obviously I got it with a discount. The other one I got, again, my favorite color, this mint one. And obviously it caught my eye because it's my favorite color, but also it has this shoulder cutouts. So your shoulder peeks through right there and it has this really cool detailing around the shoulder that I thought was really cute. So yeah, other than that, it's pretty basic, but I just really like the detailing around the shoulders. I don't have anything actually with shoulder cutouts, even though shoulder cutouts was like a really big trend. Um, I guess I never got on that trend. I wanted to make some shirts, but I never did. So here we are. And yeah. Then since I was kind of trying to buy stuff that was more for cold weather, I got this black leather, well, leather jacket. And I really liked it because of the quilting detail and then also the studs that are added to it. It has these smaller circular studs and then it has the actual pyramid studs and there's the quilted detail right there and it's just kind of your basic moto jacket it's really cute I like the fact that you can zip it all the way up or wear it open with the collar folded back and it just looks like that I'll put it on for you but it's very edgy and really cute throw it on top of a t-shirt and you instantly look like you put in a lot more effort into your outfit than you really did and I have a black kind of leather jacket like this already but it doesn't have all the studs and everything so this one is a lot cooler so yeah continuing with the studded theme because I'm still obsessed with studs even though that's like a trend from like last year at least I'm still obsessed with it it's never gonna go out of style to me so I got this studded bustier and we actually have a ton of these in the store a ton of different kinds right now well they're starting to sell out now but um, we still have some and I was surprised because like over the summer everyone loved these they were all over tumblr everyone wanted these but no one could ever find them like 
Forever 21 wasn't quite selling them. None of the basic stores were selling them. You had to like get them from, you know, more expensive, like more like online stores and stuff like that. And they're always really expensive. Or I would see people would find vintage ones in thrift stores and then go ahead and add their own studs and stuff like that. But I could never find one that fit me. And it was really frustrating because I really loved this trend. I just couldn't ever find it for a reasonable price. But now, finally, regular stores are starting to finally get onto that trend. So we actually have a million different kinds of these now at Wet Seal. Um, so I got this one because I liked the um, gold studs, of course. So it has the studs, different kinds, and it also has a really pretty um, see-through lace back. And it's padded and everything, adjustable straps and everything, just like a real bustier. And it's really cute, so I'm excited to wear this. And originally, it costs $14.50. And my last studded item, once again, my favorite color. Um, you can totally tell I'm obsessed with this color and I'm obsessed with studs. Um, it's this little crossbody purse. It has a long strap to go across like so. And I just really liked it because of the color and because of the studs. That's pretty much the only reason why I got it. And I've been carrying around my green Dooney and Berg crossbody bag, but I don't wear green. That was a gift. I didn't pick out the color of it, so it doesn't ever really match anything that I wear, so I don't really carry it a lot. But this one matches a lot of my clothes because I've been obsessed with this color. Love the studs, it's really cute. So now I can always use this one. And inside, I bought some earrings, also from Wet Seal, also mint color. They are these little rose earrings. See if you can see that. They're like little roses and they're once again my favorite mint color so they match the bag, they match the pullover, they match the dress. I actually wore these with the dress and I never really buy jewelry these days because I have an extensive jewelry collection already because I collected like vintage jewelry at one point so I kind of have a lot of jewelry so I never really buy jewelry but you know sometimes it's good to get some new different kinds so I got these since it matches all my stuff. And the last thing from Wet Seal that I got um, was kind of a really weird way that I came about it. Um, sometimes we have customers who have bought something online or they bought something at another location and we don't actually carry that item but they can still return it to our location. So sometimes we get this odd item back into our store that we don't usually carry and these wedge sneakers were one of those items we didn't actually have them in our location but a customer came and returned them to our location so we happened to just get a pair of these from that customer and they happened to be my size and i looked at them and i've been of course seeing this trend around everywhere um, for a while now um even sketchers makes a pair now and I kind of thought it was cool, but I kind of thought it was weird, and it looked weird on some people, it looked cool on some people, but I felt like it was destiny that I had to get these because they were the only pair, they were my size. Um, it was a color that I liked, I actually did like these a lot, and with my discount, they cost like $7. So, I... I decided, you know, for that cheap I can go ahead and get them and experiment with the style since it is very trendy. I know a lot of people think these are really cool, but a lot of people think they're really ugly. I haven't quite made up my mind. I think they're pretty cute. I think there's some styling I can do with these. And they have the laces and then they have the velcro that goes over top. And of course they have the wedge. It's probably like a three three and a half inch wedge so it does actually give you some height they're easy to walk in because they're like wedge sneakers so they're pretty comfortable from what I've tried them on I haven't wore them for like a full day or anything yet so I'm not sure but yeah I thought they looked pretty legit for the price so I went ahead and got them you guys can let me know in the comments down below what you think of the wedge sneaker trend yay or nay then I want to show you what I actually got for Christmas from my parents because all that stuff was just stuff that I bought for myself as like a Christmas present to myself. Um, I also bought my sister some boots and stuff from there but yeah. Um, but my mom, she has been noticing that I've been obsessed with the color mint. So she went ahead and got me some mint colored jewelry for Christmas. She got me these dangly earrings that have the mint color on them like this 
I wore them today. And then she got me this bracelet, which I really like. It's got like the rhinestones and the mint color. So she got me those two things to match all of the mint stuff that she noticed that I was buying. And I didn't ask for anything for Christmas, so this is totally her idea. And then the big shocker um, of what the last piece of clothing that I got for Christmas, I'm wearing them right now because I wanted to try them on. Um, she got me a pair of black milk leggings. You guys have been following me on anything for any amount of time. You've probably seen me talk about them and say that I want them and never actually be able to buy them because they're kind of pricey for leggings, but they're really, really awesome and I've always wanted them. So she got me these ones. They're the Galaxy Edition. So she got me the Galaxy ones and they look like this. Um, it's kind of like purples, reds, oranges with like mint colored star type things on them and they're just totally wild and crazy just like I like my leggings so I really really like them I was really surprised because I didn't ask for them she just noticed that I was talking about them on my tumblr and she went ahead and picked me out a pair that she thought I would like and she got them for me and they're really cool and I'm totally excited to wear them and style them and they match with some of my mint stuff because it actually has mint in it and I always wanted these so I'm super excited so yeah I'm really excited about those leggings because I always wanted them and she totally knew what I wanted without me having to say it so thanks mom but um yeah only other thing is my dad thought I'd throw this in here my dad got me this um little beanie from when he went to the Cowboys game any Cowboys fans out there I'm not really a sports fan at all but he's a Cowboys fan so yeah, my head is like way too big for regular beanies. But yeah, so that's pretty much it. Um, Christmas shopping for myself, always good. Um, obsessed with mint, obsessed with studs. Let me know what you guys got for Christmas and let me know what you think of the stuff I bought for myself for Christmas. Other than that, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Subscribe to be updated of new videos, like this video for more like this one, check out my online clothing store, find me on Twitter, Tumblr, and Instagram, and thank you for watching.